Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Uh, back at the file select screen for just a moment. You see that number one right next to my file name? That means deaths! I died! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, so let's try to finish up the bottle grotto. I should be able to finish it in this video, but if not, it'll probably just be the boss in the last video. Let's see if it's a statue. No! I know! I know I can't pick up the pots. Jesus. Okay. First, defeat the imprisoned Poles voice. Last, Stalfos. Now, that is a hint on how to get the Nightmare Key. And when I was younger, I had no idea how to get this Nightmare Key. I couldn't figure out the puzzle. But it's pretty easy to figure out once you think about it. And you know what's, what room you're supposed to go in. Ah, right, damn it. Let's see what's in... No, get in the chest. So yeah, we get the map halfway through the dungeon. Where we really don't need it anymore. I think this is rupees. Yep. 20 rupees. Joy. I wouldn't say joy, but... It's nice. In here, we have ghosts. Turn on a light to make them uh, visible and attackable. And in here we get the power bracelet. At last you can pick up pots and stones. Finally. Could have used that a few videos ago. So, what are some things I can talk about? Um, well, I finished Path of Radiance. The main game of it, anyways. I'm glad that's finally over. The extra videos shouldn't be that burdensome, though. Should only take me three videos tops. Eh. Come here. Okay, the nightmare key room is coming up, so we'll be there shortly. Eh, whatever. I don't need that rupee yet. Okay, so now we have to do what that uh, owl statue said. Uh, we have to destroy the imprisoned guy first. You can destroy him with a pot. Damn it, I killed the Stalfos. And I can't kill the Stalfos. Aw, oh, damn it. He disappeared. Just go up the stairs and back down. He'll, re he'll reappear. Okay, get out of the way. And in that order, we get the boss key, or the nightmare key, whatever it's called. And I think that's about it for this dungeon. Yep, that's about it. Just go through this door and the boss will be... And I have to go down a flight of stairs, but he'll be there shortly. Gotta kill the stupid bunny rabbit thing. And yes, you have to use a pot, a bow and arrow, or a bomb to kill those guys. Your sword won't kill them. <clears throat> this is a heavy platform. You need a pot in order to lower it. And here we have the boss door. The boss really isn't that hard. With uh, a little bit of control lag, he might be a little difficult, but nothing I shouldn't be able to handle. Plus, I have the Guardian Acorn, so that'll get off a few of my damage. So, since this is the Bottle Grottle, we have to fight a genie in a bottle. Nah, nah, you can't hurt me as long as I have my bottle. Okay, so that means we can't hurt him unless his bottle breaks. Avoid the fire. You'll go into his bottle, hit the bottle with your sword. I can't move, but I am still alright. Your little sword won't break this bottle. Well, maybe a wall can. Idiot. So yeah, you have to repeat this cycle for a little while. I think three times. Three usually is the magic number. Get away from me. 
Yep, one more time. And after you... Oh, wait, no. Oh, wait, no, he just says the line again. Get over here and start running from the fireballs. Okay. And here is phase two. His bottle breaks and he'll start to run around the room and randomly throw fireballs at you. So, let's see. He also does that weird circle thing. But not a very hard fight. He only takes off half a heart, I think. It might be a full heart since I have the acorn. One more hit should do it. Or, no, one more hit now. Ah, no. Come on. Okay, one more hit. Okay, there we go. We get a heart container, and now we can leave. We have the second siren instrument, the conch horn. Notice how the instrument is playing the same song that it played in when we got the first instrument. But it's making that instrument sound now, instead of uh, the other one. Prairie, prairie, the prairie is waiting. Looks like we're going to a prairie next. But look, we still have Bow Wow. And we can also go over here. An area we couldn't access before. Actually, that's a lie. We were here earlier, so... That's kind of a lie. <laughs> hmm. Let's see. Trying to find some places to go. Uh. Camera? Oh, I think this is exclusive to the... DX version of the game, which means I'll cover it in the extras. Oh, what's this? Hi there, big guy. I'm Crazy Tracy. I got a little secret for sale that'll pump you up. Okay. Will you give me 28 rupees for my secret? Sure. I'm made of money. So, uh, this is secret medicine. Uh, whenever you die while holding the secret medicine, uh, your life will be regenerated, so it's like giving Link an extra life. Kinda cool. But now that we have the power bracelet, we can uncover stones that have been hindering our path for a while. Uh, let's see if we get anything in here. Don't think the rock's feather will be able to make that jump, so... We'll probably need another item before we can get that. And yes, I realize I missed an acorn. Don't care. Ooh, what's this? Well, this looks like a torch, so... Magic powder... Hey, a firefly! Hey, kid, you woke me up from a fine nap. Thanks a lot. But now I'll get my revenge. Are you ready? Uh, sure. I'll let you carry more magic powder. Hee <laughs> hee. Are you ready? Y yeah. Okay. I don't see how that is revenge, but... But we now can hold 40 magic powder. That's pretty convenient. That kind of reminds me of the... Uh, black treasure chest guy in uh, Paper Mario at Thousand Year Door. Piece of power! Okay, I'll get two things before I end my game, or my, the recording. Uh, if I remember right, um, I have still yet to get this one piece of heart that's in this cave. Oh wait, not here. It's over here. Uh, someone actually pointed this out in the comments section. Uh, don't worry, I realized I skipped this, but that's because you need the power bracelet in order to get this. Uh, let's see, move this stone here. Lift these stones, and sure enough, a piece of heart. Press select on the subscreen to see. And yes, we collected four pieces, so now we got a new heart container. We're up to six now. Okay. Ah, uh, jeez, I don't have very much time. Uh, I'll get the next uh, treasure chest I'm trying to get, and then I'll probably end the video there. So, I'll just go ahead and do that really quickly. The chest is... Right around here. Yep, here it is. Die. 
I think this is going to be a secret shell. Yep. You found a secret seashell. If you collect a lot of these, something good is bound to happen. Let's hope so. But that about does it for this video. Uh, I'm Slim Kirby. This has been Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Join us next time to when we uh, return Bow Wow to his rightful owner. See you guys later.